Hey, I'm Ben Turner, the local community manager. Let's take a look at how we can use the Atlas Headless WP add-on. First things first, you gotta install the Atlas add-on. So if you've enabled the Atlas add-on, go ahead to create a new site. Under the custom environment, Select your version of server software for the WordPress site. And then finally, enable the Atlas add-on for the site. So from here, Local is provisioning services, getting all the things it needs. So once the site's been created, you'll see that we've got the WordPress backend right there and we've got the front end here we can open the front end of the site by clicking the open site button and we can open the back end of the site clicking the admin button in terms of like getting a view of the code you'll notice that we've got the sleepy hollow there's the front end under the node folder which has JavaScript files and whatnot. And then there's the typical WordPress backend here. Once you're done, or once the site's been finished uh, being created, uh, let's highlight how you can make changes and how those changes are automatically compiled. Um, open up your text editor on, into the app node folder. And if we wanted to add a menu item, we can go to that components folder open the header.tsx file. Let's say we wanted to add something after the about page. We can go about and I'll just reuse that and say pumpkins and uh, let's have that go to the pumpkin muffins page. We can save and you notice that that shows up in the in the main nav of the site. If you're wanting to see the output of and kind of the compiling information, go to local, show output. This create this shows you a terminal window. From here, you can return to what you were doing um, and make those changes again. So comment out that save the file, those changes are compiling and are reflected in the browser.